I think there's still a little personality differences that maybe if you weren't around her all the time you wouldn't notice, but there are still small changes that aren't the same. Oh, probably two and a half weeks after my accident, Alicia set me up an appointment in Topeka. I said, well, Alicia, I can't drive. And so she, of course, then calls my mom and dad, and my mom and dad, who are in their 70s, drive me to Topeka. And I get there, and I didn't bring my purse along. I didn't bring my cell phone along. I just walked out of the house with a shirt on the back. I, you know, go to church on a regular basis, and I didn't go to church for three weeks because the thought of being in church and around people was scary. Um, the first time I went to church, I sat on the end of the pew, and it was kind of like um, almost an anxiety. I had to breathe through it and say, Donna, you can make it through this, and you know, you, you're gonna be okay. Um, and I, I did. Um, I have returned to work now. Initially, I went back just two hours a day for two days. On a Thursday and a Friday, I went back. And by an hour and a half my first day, I was looking at my watch and saying, you know, this is enough. You know, because at work, I, I'm a supervisor, so I was checking my emails. And the, the lights, the movement on the screen was way too stimulating. But I got through it and the second day was a little better. Then the next week, my release was I could work four hours a day, the five days, and I did a Monday and a Tuesday. Wednesday I did not go in and then I went in Thursday and Friday. So I have gradually worked back. Now I have a full release. I'm, I can work 40 hours. Maybe I'm a little old school. I use just a little pocket 2011 calendar and I would say that I probably am more diligent about writing appointments down, writing what I need to do today. Um, maybe I print off an email of like, you're gonna come visit me. I print off the email and I have that as a security so that I make sure I'm in the right place at the right time and I don't make somebody drive here and I wasn't where I was supposed to be. Where were you, Donna? I for, you know, I don't wanna say I've forgotten. I would guess my biggest success is that I'm driving again. You know, I drove to Topeka by myself. Um, I'm, I'm going back to work. I am, um, you know, when, when something comes together, it's like, yes, that felt good.